Okay. This is just a quick announcements. So this one won't take too very long. I have mentioned this in a previous video that actually won't come out until I think on the 27th, but I am going to go ahead and mention it again. I thought it is a three second delay with this piece of junk of a screen recorder. Instead, it seems like it is a five second delay. So you are going to probably hear a longer delay. Um, but I don't like this screen record. I am still trying to figure out a better one that I can buy. Ugh. Now, I also mentioned this in one that is to be released, I believe, on the 27th. That this is it. That this is an educational channel. Therefore, at any time, the Fair Use Act may be in play. Okay. Education. Now, from this point on, this is something new that I have just been actually working on just here in the last hours. As of 727, 5 Acts 17 apologetics videos will be released hopefully every day for about a year. He had about 1,551 or 52 videos before he have actually deleted several and handed it over to Hatun Tosh. Now, I don't have them all, so I will go ahead and upload what I do have, which is around 1,500, so I will still need to try to find the ones I don't have to then try to download them. But on several of his videos, he gives verbal permission to do what is about to be done. He gives verbal consent in several of his videos. DCCI, I have gotten Hatun Tosh permission to do that to one of hers. So I only have one of hers on my channel. Until I get a bigger permission, that's all that written permission gives me to do is that one video. Now, based on the Fair Use Act, I can take pieces of hers and I can work it into mine. That is, that, that is fair use. Other people can do the same thing with mine. It is called Fair Use Act as long as it is educational. Take pieces, not the whole thing, without permission. 
unto thee, O Lord, my that of un, unto thee, O Lord, and the truth verses has a cross as a cross um, permission to then run each other videos when it becomes necessary. Christian Prince also does several verbal consents in his in his as well, just like David Wood in Acts 17 Apologetics. Now, you may wonder why all of these different abbreviations. Well, because of all of this that I am doing, I will be now adding these to, to the title of each one of to each one of the uh, to each one of the videos so that you as the viewer knows if it is mine it would be TTV the truth versus okay if it is from unto the O Lord it will be UTOL if it is the one from DCCI it'll have DCCI at the end the about 1500 from Acts 17 apologetics it'll it is going to have A17A. And when I start doing some of the Christian prints, it will have CP. And then there will be the OIC. Oops, I forgot. To do. Oh, because... It will all be in, um, it all be in, it is a level, it's a per, in that, of, um, it is a level, it's a per, it is a level, in those things at the end of each of the video titles, okay? So that you know. Now there will be two, and I thought it was three, other implied consent because I can't really tell where it is from, but here is one of them proof that Jesus is God in the Quran part two. There's a part one and a part two, and I thought that there was a part three. But these two I will actually then download and also create its own actual playlist. That is something else I am doing, is creating a playlist. OIC will have a playlist which is going to include those two that I have just shown you, CP. If RC also actually allows it, I don't remember. But if RC allows it, then RC will be in there. And also... Um, DCCI will be in there because they will be just a few. But 
Acts 17 will have its own playlist because it'll be, well, almost all of them. I don't know if I will be able to find the final about 50 that I am missing. I hope I can. But this is just an update of a few changes that is going on in the, the Truth Versus channel. This gives you an idea of what all these actually mean. Everything with the TTV will not have its own playlist. Okay. Thank you, and have a wonderful day.